Paute Part 2, and an interview. Here's your story, let's begin. The world is fine, come on, dive in. The future's here, it's right before your eyes. Here we were just uh, strolling around town, checking out the sights, looking at the beautiful flowers, uh, ran into that carnival uh, with the rides. It was a little rainy um, in these pictures, the rain had pretty much eased off, but it was raining on and off uh, the whole time. And on one of the back roads, I think it's on the east side of town, uh, over where that hotel is. I stumbled across this uh, restaurant, bar, with a pig with wings. Its name is Jesse. And um, I was across the street right there taking pictures of it. And people behind us came up and said hello, and it turned out to be the owners. And they took us in. It was closed, but they took us in, showed us around, and... Um, I asked to pick the one that puts a little bit of 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 a little bit I'm Ava Pesantes, and this is Nelson Pesantes. I'm born and raised in Boca, New York. Nelson is from Paute, Ecuador, and we live in New York, um, but come back here to visit and to take care of our restaurant. Now, when did you build this place? You built it from the ground up. Yes, and it took about... Three years ago. Yeah, we started the process three years ago. It took us a year to build it, and this is going to be our first anniversary this Saturday. Oh, nice. Yeah. So it's a big party. It's not just carnival, but it's it's no. a party yeah. for yourself, yes, too. Yes, it's going to be a party yeah. for yourself. So how, how has this gone for you? Because you're long distance from here, and you just come back, you know, once in a while. How, how does it work out for you? It works pretty well. Nelson's sisters and brother run it for us while we're not here, and it just it seems to have been a good fit. Yes. And we come back periodically to check on things, to revise, review menu items. Um, Thank you, yes. Yeah. Now you have a great menu. Thank you. Now, how did you decide to have that menu? What's on that menu? Uh, we wanted to bring a New York bar to Ecuador. It's, um, it's like so. a sports pub. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Exactly. So you get ribs and wings and burgers, burgers and fries. Something that you don't really find here. Yeah, not the way that you find it here, just not in the way that we do it. Yeah. Uh, it's really, you know, we brought the American way of food, or this particular food to Paute. Now, do you have plans eventually of actually moving here? Eventually. Eventually, yes. I, we need to build our house first. Yes. So you're both, you're working there and just setting up your life. Yeah. Basically. Yeah. That's the... The plan. The plan. To one day to move back here and have a peaceful life without all that noise that New York has. That's, that's my plan. Were you sure, were you confident that an American theme bar, restaurant would go over well? Or was that, because there's none other that exists here, right? In this, in we Paute? Probably, no. no. I and mean, we both felt pretty confident that it would work for that exact reason. It's something completely different. Um, and obviously easy for us to do because we live it. Well, I give you credit because 
it's still a leap of faith. You're putting so much into something, and you really there's still that element of I I hope that's going to work out, right? I think that that's with any business that you create from bottom up. Um, you know, again, I think because there was nothing like it, at least it would draw people in initially mm -hmm. for curiosity, um, and then they're going to stay because they like what they see, they like what they eat, the environment is good. Um, it's a fun party on the weekends. Do you ever have live music here? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And DJs as well. So it's local bands from Cuenca. Yes. From Cuenca, the big city. <laughs> from the big city. Yes. It's not enough, not enough here in politics. Uh, we try to bring bands from Cuenca, the people from Palo are my from. So yeah, we do. We do bring live music once a month. Nice. Figures you wouldn't be open tonight. Looks delicious. Yeah. You know you could.